hey guys uh, welcome back to another update on my hair ever since I used the product mild which I've been pronouncing this product wrong the name of this product wrong I think it was Millie but after watching a few videos I realized other people pronounced it mild so today is Wednesday and it's finally after the had the long holiday because when this happened when the mild product destroyed my hair horrible it happened the saturday which was the 24th of december 2022 um the next day was christmas the other day was boxing day they celebrate christmas on the monday instead of the sunday and then the tuesday was a holiday as well so today is wednesday so finally i can go to a professional stylist to do a consultation so they can tell me um, what can be done at this point with the condition of my hair I am hoping that my hair can be fixed but I know deep down it cannot be fixed but I'm trying to stay positive and hoping for the best because it is so bad like it's extremely bad and oh God, let me just show you guys I've been wearing this scarf on my head ever since it had happened because I cannot bear to look at my long healthy thick hair that I have been working on for so long to be in the condition that it was healthy long strong and thick and in a couple seconds one product destroyed my hair like I just I'm so confused that a product can do such dramatic damage to someone's hair in just a few seconds I just don't understand like I just I'm just so lost hey guys so i am at the salon and she already started detangling my hair the only reason why i am just recording it was because she did not wanted me to record some people just do not allow recording in their place of business which i respect that so um i didn't get it i didn't get to record from the beginning but after we were there um, I'm explaining things to her and she gave me the go ahead to start recording so I could share this process with you guys. At first when I went there and she saw the condition of my hair, she didn't want to touch it because I mean like nobody wants to be responsible, right? So she did some research and she researched the product and everything like that she examined my hair and she was like I cannot help you your hair is like very 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 tangled and it's gonna be like it's gonna take hours and it may not you're gonna like experience a lot of breakage and nobody really wants to be responsible for your hair falling out basically so when I was gonna leave she said to me okay let me just try one thing and then if it work I will continue and see how it goes I felt really grateful so she did and you know we're, we were there talking and she was doing her thing and I was just explaining to her what happened and next thing you know she's detangling and detangling and she was really like distracting me from all the breakage and the shedding that was going on so I was like as you guys can see i was like in depth into conversation we were talking about hair hair care and you guys know that's my passion so it was very like a good conversation and it really really worked by distracting me to not noticing all the breakage she literally saw the disappointment on my face when she told me she can't help me and i feel that she felt sorry for me so she was like okay let me just try one thing
as I sit here and edit this video for you guys, I'm looking at the quality of my hair and my hair is extremely damaged. It is fried. It looks awful. It looks like it hasn't been moisturized for decade. And the quality is just so bad, like really bad. And I'm going to have to work really, really, really hard on my hair to restore the strength, the health and the quality of my hair. So this is going to take me a while, which she already told me that as well, that the, my hair is damaged really bad. And even if she gets it to be detangled, it's going to be thin, it's going to be weak, it's going to be damage so i have to continue to cut treat my hair on a regular basis until it gets back to where i am comfortable with the health and thickness of my hair so basically this video is all about the detangling process of my knotted hair so guys just sit back and enjoy <music>
so finally after hours of standing and detangling my hair i think she's finally finished and i felt like really good not feeling that big ball of knotted hair in my head i was pretty excited that i wasn't going to go bald that i'm gonna actually save some hair like you guys see me laughing i couldn't believe even though the quality is so bad and it's so thin it felt so light and so thin but i was still so grateful and so happy that i'm not going to go bald i can actually save some of my hair so she told me she's gonna have to cut it because it's stringy which i am totally fine with that because i rather have like a healthy thicker hair <music> It was very sad to see all my hair on the floor and I don't know I just don't know how to explain the feeling but this was actually really sad and I just grouped them up I told her I want my hair to take home with me so I just take them up and I literally still have them after two months I literally still have the hair <laughs> now she's gonna wash and treat my hair so after fully detangled now it's time to cleanse and treat she said she's gonna do three different things to my hair i think it was three to try to restore it as much as possible because it's extremely damaged we were talking and laughing because i felt so grateful that i still have hair left on my head even though it was damaged but I'm like, okay, I'm going to work really, really hard on it. I already conditioned my mind. I already understand the assignment. She talked to me. She gave me tips and stuff like that. So
so guys this is the end result as you guys can see the quality is not perfect it still look dry it still look damaged it still look trashy but she did her best and i am super 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 grateful now it's my turn to go on this new journey this new hair care journey starting from beginning i have to start on my hair care journey all over and i just want you guys to come along with me i'm going to mostly do diys to grow my hair back because i don't really trust these all natural organic hair care lines anymore and i promised myself that i gonna try my very best so this does not happen to me again so i'll be making most of my products at home and i will definitely definitely share with you guys each step of the way so anybody wants to come on this hair journey with me um please feel free to please subscribe so we can go on this journey together to get healthy thick and long hair relax hair so i told her to put it in a ponytail because i you know i just didn't want to deal with it either so i told her to put it into a ponytail she did i have a short little ponytail but that's fine i still have you on my head and i'm super grateful thank god i pray to god that i don't have to go bald and he makes sure that i am not bald so i am grateful thank you lord thank you jesus and thank you all for your tips and thank you for your your concern and your checking in i got some messages on instagram even though i haven't got a chance to reply to you guys' messages trust me i'm super super grateful so guys these are these are the hair that she cut so i'm just picking these up as well to take home with me i think i want to store them until i let go of them So this is the final final result which is the final length the final quality the final everything thank you all for your generous support throughout this entire journey please subscribe to my channel hey guys um so i am back home from the salon and uh, as you guys can see i got a little clips um and as you guys can see the stylist tried her very best to save as much as of my hair that she could i have experienced a lot of breakage um with the result of that she had to cut here so in order for because if she didn't do that it would have been like very stringy very very thin it's still very thin but at least it looks a little better so she had to cut i think it looks like about five five six inches off my hair i am um, like i feel like i like if she hadn't like well, when i when, when i went there she was like mm -mm, there's no saving this hair there is no saving it this i've never seen anything like this before and she said let me just try one thing and if it work then i will try my very best to save as much of your hair as possible so she went and get a product and she got different uh style combs and she gently like really really gentle um tried to detangle my hair and it took her a few hours a few hours and finally like i started like if you guys watching the video you guys see where i was laughing because she was telling me stuff to distract me so i wouldn't feel as depressed about my hair so i wouldn't pay attention to the breakage and the thinness and the damage that the mild product have done to my hair so she was giving me jokes she was like just trying to distract me because she know like when she's she, she's like she's like oh my god you are attached to your hair 
like you literally obsessed with your hair i'm like yes i am obsessed with my hair so but anyways she did she treats my hair she did she did like three different things to try to restore it as much as possible and I really really even though I lost so much hair I really 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 think she did an amazing job judging from the condition my hair was in and the state I really thought I was gonna have to trim my head my all my hair and go like look like, like a fucking monk excuse my language I really thought I was gonna look like a monk so I am very 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 grateful <laughs> Of course, I'm hurt about my hair that I'm lost. My hair is so damaged, like extremely damaged. And she said that it's going to take me a while to restore my hair back to its original state. So I just have to continue to trim. So trim, treat, and try to care for my hair as best as possible until my hair restore or get at get at least a, like maybe close to what it was so um basically i tell myself that it will take me at least a year to restore my hair back to its original state for the thickness the health i'm not even too worried about the length as much as the health and the thickness to be honest with you because the length will come but it was so hurt it was so much hurt to see how much hair that i have lost <sighs> but anyway guys this is this is she after she treated and tried to restore it um she cut and she blow dry my hair only blow dry and this is the hair like you guys know how thick my hair is and this is what left and this is what it looks like I have like a necklace when you go into one. I have to start over my hair care. I have to start all over. <sighs> so anyway, guys, I will keep you guys on the journey of restoring my hair again of its original health thickness and length so if you're not yet subscribed to my channel please subscribe to my channel i will post all the things that i will be doing to restore my hair to its original form if you guys would like to come on this journey with me please subscribe I'm just so sad, you know, like, I'm just so sad. Because it's not fair. But, anyway guys, please subscribe to my channel. And let's go on this journey together. So, um, I saved the hair, I know that's all like hurt and obsessed i am with i am at the moment so i saved the hair so i have this big ball of hair right here this is from detangling this is what she took out from detangling it trying to you guys see that god like this is all the breakage from detangle and then now this is from what she cut so it's all like in a ball like like I just scoop them up and trying to take them with me but yes guys I know and then what's left of my perfectly 
healthy, thick, long hair. Any of you that are wondering what product am I talking about exactly, this is the product. It is the Rosemary Mint Strengthening Shampoo infused with biotin and encourages growth. A lot of people is also saying this line is a natural, natural hair line, right? But it has stated no way or form on this bottle that it's supposed to be used in natural hair. Okay? No way or form. I read the label over and over again to make sure I'm missing anything. It did not state the type here. And I can't assume everything should be on the label. So this is... And you want to know the funny thing, guys? I remember when I bought this, I bought it at the CVS Pharmacy. I bought the entire line. Yes, I did. I bought the entire line. I also bought the goat oil, but my daughter threw it on the floor and break, break it. So that's why I don't have it. And all of them are full because I don't use it. I haven't used these yet. Use the shampoo and the condition, you guys see the condition of my hair. This is just crazy. 